Often you hear a lot of electronic music um, being recorded direct into uh, an interface or a board so there's no acoustic sound or if there, if there is it's synthetically applied with reverb, a reverb plugin or something and then an acoustic recording on top of it. So you get this fight between these two worlds. So looping for me is a very important process as far as composition is concerned. And it doesn't even really matter if um, the repetition of it doesn't matter. You can have a loop that's three minutes long and, and work inside of that. Um, the great thing about it is um, in comparison to working, for instance, with MIDI, um, where the, um, electronic music can feel very cold when you're composing, Looping this way, uh, at least in the way that I'm um, singing and playing guitar and using different instruments, I get to have that visceral feel of, of seeing how, this, how the music feels when you play it. And that informs me a lot of, uh, that informs a lot of my composition. There is a narrative, there is a, a, a kind of arc in, in its color, um, but in a way I kind of leave it up to the listener to, uh, to interpret that however they would like to. Some people say it's happy, some people say it's kind of manic, and, and some people say it's kind of naive, and they're all right. And I hope people understand that the journey of it is the thing that's it's really thrilling to me, and that it's, I'm not using it in a way to show how complicated things can be or how um, crazy things can be. It's a very honest approach at, 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 at this music and I hope people can appreciate it from that angle.